Hi, I'm Linda from Ann Arbor. I come from a very dysfunctional childhood that could not accommodate my basic needs nor support me with challenges. Through no fault of my own, my mom kicked me out into the world without anything, not even the shoes on my feet. Life took me from homes that took advantage of me, did unsafe things, and exposed me to things I wish I never had to be exposed to. I never had, um, and they always left me at a loss as what to do next. It was fortunate that I had a car that could house me many nights. I could scream, why again? Why is insanity stealing away from me all that I want to do? The nights were sleepless. The days were busy acquiring another job, another college credit, and another unknown. Work was a trade-off for food. Another room was available in exchange for someone else's need and no relationships ever lasted. I can honestly say I never had a midlife crisis because I was in crisis through the middle of my life. 20 years ago, Avalon Housing gave me my very own key to my very own affordable apartment. I didn't have to adapt to any other lifestyles, habits, problems, etc. Avalon gave me the ability to get basic needs met, freedom to navigate resources, obtain solid employment, and seek new opportunities. Critical to being able to wean myself off from survival skills and improve my mental health, Avalon has housing supports, and I got into therapy. Today, I work full-time, volunteer, engage in interest, and live in the community in which I belong. My biggest wish is for anyone who is struggling with homelessness to obtain their own key to a safe, stable place to call their own. Avalon Housing is working very hard in my community. I'm aware of HUD Housing city housing commission in my area. They too struggle with meeting the high demand and the main needs of homeless folks. Because thousands of homeless people here in Michigan day and night need support, advocacy, and financial resources, you can make a difference. I ask that housing be a priority when making budget decisions. I ask that monies are more substantial in ensuring all Michiganders have a place to call home. Please consider my story as evidence, not only a need, but a solution into the next year, or even 10, 20 years from now. Consider what your life would be like through no fault of your own, you had no place to live. Imagine you simply lack the ability to earn enough to afford housing costs. Think about those who are living paycheck to paycheck and cannot afford to pay rent. There are dis many dysfunctional families that are not able to be available for each other. Maybe sickness saps all the money one has. There are thousands of stories with complex chapters of life. Let's finally put a happy ending to many lives. More and more people content at home, sweet home. Thank you.